Hey guys, it's Lisa and I have some Target deals for you. So I did the spend 40, earn a $10 Target gift card, as well as a couple other deals. So everything here ended up being a cost of $7. So for the spend 40, earn 10, I have the two pack of the Colgate for $3.99, the single Colgate for $2.49. I have two different dub, one was $6.69 and one was $7.39. Pure Zero Shampoo is $5.99, Cetaphil at $8.99, and Crest at $4.99. So it's $40.53. I had digital Target coupons. I had a $4 coupon and a $3 coupon for the Dove products. And check your store because there are a lot of clearance Dove that do work for the gift card, um, and the $4 and $3 coupons work on those. Unfortunately, my store did not have any of them, so that could make for a better deal. Um, you know, you can throw some more things in here. The Pure Zero, we have a 40% off Target that took off a $1.80, and we had a $2 manufacturer coupon. Cetaphil, $3, and Crest, $3. So after all of the coupons, it was $23.73. I earned the $10 gift card. I earned $5.75 back from the Ibotta app, a $2 and $1.25 for the Colgate, and $2.50 for the Cetaphil, and a dollar back on Fetch for the Dove. So it's a cost of $6.98 total. Of course, check your apps to make sure you have those same deals. The other items I purchased, the Clorox $5.29, we have a $2 manufacturer coupon, $2 I bought a rebate, and then $2 back from Shopkick makes it a 71 cent moneymaker. The Glade at $2.39, we have a dollar coupon, so you're gonna pay $1.39, and then the Ibotta app's giving you a dollar back, so 39 cents. And then some of the Schick razors are on sale for $4. You're gonna to wanna to submit for $4 back on coupons.com or ShopMium if you have that option. There is a $4 digital, but it doesn't take off the full $4. It takes off, I think it was $3.89. Um, you know, something like that. So it's still a really cheap, great deal if that's the way you have to do it but you might be better off um, just not clipping the Target coupon and instead submitting for coupons.com or ShopMium or whichever app that you use. So again, everything here was a total of $7, so definitely not a bad deal, especially when you consider that a lot of the items um, you know, in the gift card deal were over $7 on their own. So just a possible scenario if you're thinking on doing the gift card deal, um, but thanks for watching, guys. Have a great day.